Welcome back to another episode of In The Coffee Shop I haven't made a video in here for a very long time, you know And that is really because I've been procrastinating a lot I keep telling myself, oh I have to look um, good, I need to get a haircut in order for me to create videos Or oh, my space needs to be, you know I thought absolute best, like everything needs to be um, where they're supposed to be In order for me to create content, right? And that has created so much roadblock for me to actually like create which has made it uh you know um very challenging that's why i haven't been posting that much and also just editing some of this content for has been on uh, very stressful so um so then by cutting all that because uh um, right now my kitchen is looking a mess which is where this coffee shop is my living room is looking a mess also but I'm gonna create regardless just for me to get over that hump right because if I keep telling myself that I'm probably never going to create anymore because my apartment is never going to look 100% I was actually reading this book called Atomic Habit a couple of weeks ago and one thing the author spoke about on getting a habit stick is to make it like very easy what does that mean for example let's say if I want to make going to the gym a habit for right? like working out a habit the first thing I need to do is to make sure the gym is very close to me so that way um, I don't have to stress too much about driving to the gym or like uh, you know doing this thing if the gym is very close to me that's like one of the mental challenges I've already um, um, cut off right because I can easily walk to the gym or I can easily just drive five minutes to the gym right but if the gym is about 20-30 minutes away then that's another hurdle I have to jump over, right? Because, man, do I really want to, like, drive 30 minutes today to work out? And once you start questioning yourself like that, right? Like, it's, uh, you miss one day, the next day becomes easy to miss again. And, yeah, that's, uh, that's how it goes. Like, you miss the whole week without working out. And after a period of time, like, you just <laughs> get used to not working out. So um, that's the same thing about creating, right? Like making it very easy and still trying to figure out like the best possible way to do that. Whether it's just, um, you know, not caring too much about like what the audio sounds like because typically I would have like a podcast in mic here for like play audio, but this audio too is pretty good for my um, camera mic. And I usually have like this big um, light boom also that I set up for like good lighting which is all good right like increase the quality but if that's the case then you may have to sacrifice on some other things right so today I just have like uh, this little light and so far it looks good on my camera screen so let's see uh, if there's any difference but I'm trying to create as much as I can right and just uh, you know see how much value i can put out so speaking of having to have like a nice space set up uh in order for me to shoot which is something i've been struggling with um personally right because i keep having all this um random stuff in my apartment and bringing um new things keep buying stuff and i tend to figure out over time that some of these things i've been collecting really have no use for me like i don't really use them that much so um, I've been going through a massive, massive clean out also Whereas I'm going through every stuff in my kitchen, right? Questioning like when was the last time I used this? Do I really need to um, keep having it? Because I found myself like doing this all the time too Oh, this thing I don't really use it right now But I may use it like a couple months down the road And now what I'm doing if I found myself doing that Like I really don't need that stuff because Really, I don't get to use any of those stuff at all. They're just taking up space, right? And one big prime example actually is I have like so many plates, spoons, and cups. I leave them myself. Like, why do I need so many of them? Because I keep telling myself whenever my friend, my friends come over, I can I always have enough to like you know, um, you know, serve everybody. But that's not really the case most of the time, yo. So yeah, I got rid of most of my plates. I only have um, about three left. And even that, I think it's still a lot. I wanna have at least two left and maybe I can have like paper plates and um, you know, all this disposable stuff for if that ever happens, right? People come over then I will um, use this. But yeah, that's uh, my struggle 
of creating right now so um, i'm gonna try to you know um make things as effective as i can so i can do as much as i can also so um yes my water just finished boiling i hope it did not also affect my <laughs> mic but at this point it don't matter right because that's the point like just shot a bike cut like all this little huddles and just create so um yes i'm about to make my matcha thanks so much for sticking to the end of this if you all are struggling with the same things i'm struggling with also um let us know in the comments below on what solution you have in mind or what solution has worked for you or um, also check out my other stuff i do lots of contents like this uh diys top shows like this or even on um, travel content right so check them out i'll catch you guys in the next one peace out